I can't hear you very well, Mr. Dunbar. Are you trying to say that your son William has gone overseas to stay with you? And that he won't be attending classes here until you bring him home? Yes, that's correct, sir. I see, but it's quite surprising that he would leave without even bothering to tell any of us uh, here. It was a very sudden decision. You know how youngsters can be at this age. I'm sure your own <clears throat> daughter, Sissy, is capable of doing the same thing. That's very possible, yes. But I didn't realize that you knew my daughter, and by her nickname as well. Uh, that is, well, actually, I don't really know her, obviously, but well, you see, William uh, talks so much about, about her. It's always sissy this and sissy that, and so it's almost as if I really did know her. Ah, I didn't know that William was such a close friend of Elizabeth. Well, Sissy's a role model for William. An example. And how could it be otherwise? I mean, considering the sort of author that she has. Thank you, Mr. Dunbar. I was delighted to have this little chat with you. And please give William my best regards and tell him that we hope he'll return to school very soon and that he'll always be welcome. I will tell him. Goodbye, Mr. Delmas, and many thanks for your understanding. You're very welcome, sir. Phew. I guess I make a good grown-up. Yes, but now all we have to do is find William. You're right. We'd better get back to work. Piece of cake. OK, so it worked with the principal. But what'll happen when William's real parents want to see their son? Hume's right, and I'm not so sure that voice synthesizer of yours is going to do the trick, Jeremy. Who knows? Maybe by then we'll have localized William. How are you going to do that? Thanks to the data we got from my father before he disappeared into the network, Jeremy and I have just about recreated Lyoko. You're recreating Lyoko? We may even be ready by tonight. That's right. In fact, Eileen and I have worked on it every night for the last week. Ah, so that's why you look like a couple of zombies, huh? And I thought that you'd look like Rex because you weren't partying all night. I was getting jealous. Hi, Millie. Hi, Tamia. You wouldn't mind if we sat here with you, would you? Are they still sulking? What do you think? Well, you did sneak out the bathroom window in the middle of an interview. And for ace reporters like them, that is pretty insulting. Being mad at me isn't as bad as they're being really mad at each other. But how come? They had a massive argument over the newspaper, I think. You mean the Caddick news is folded for good? That's the best news I've heard in no, all No, it's time. not. How am I going to know who's going out with who now? I guess I'll have to console myself by watching Jim dancing to old disco music. He really... Hmm. Well, personally, out of all of the seasons of the year, I like the spring best of all. I like summer best because it's nice and warm. <laughs> Wait, I can't hear anything. Well, if you can't hear anything, then we should speak louder, shouldn't we? Dork, it's not you I want to listen to. Uh, don't tell me you've been watching Paco the King of Disco again. I can't help myself. Whenever I'm in a bad mood, I put the film on. I don't know why he's so ashamed that he used to be an actor. Most probably because the film was a flop. I don't see what makes their conversation more interesting than ours. Yeah, me neither. Well, I do, okay? Come in. You wanted to see me, huh, Sissy? Mm-hmm. What's she doing here? That's what I was going to say. What's she doing here? I thought it was me you wanted to see. Same here. Well, at least you agree on that. It's not much, but it's a pretty good start. And it's all thanks to me. Hmm. Which is why, for the good of the Caddick News, I've decided to become the editor-in-chief. You've decided what? Who do you think you are? The daughter of the principal. The only person who can stop you from printing that poor excuse for a paper that you're so proud of. Hmm. But you're not a real journalist. She's right. You don't even know the meaning of the word scoop. Wrong again, little ones. A scoop, huh? How about an enormous scoop? Huh? I'm all set. Mm -hmm. Here we go. I don't want to be a party pooper, but there doesn't seem to be very much happening. Uh, the data that my father transmitted wasn't enough. I guess we must have been really crazy to think that we could recreate Lyoko. Hey, wait, look at that. That's incredible. It worked. I leave it, Jeremy. You guys are gods. Well, almost, but not quite. 
For the time being, all we've been able to recreate is Sector 5 of Lyoko. We've still got to work to create the other sectors. But we should be able to do that soon. Okay, but it can wait a night or two. You guys deserve a good night's sleep. Yes, Yumi's right, Jeremy. We're going to be needing every bit of our strength to look for William. We'll get started tomorrow. Uh, yeah. Well, all right. Hey, do you guys want to watch Paco, the King of Disco, with me? It'll take your mind off things. Hey, what's this? Much news? Hmm. Let me see that. <laughs> you promised not to tell anyone and to think I actually trusted you. Jim, I didn't give you a secret away, I swear. Uh -huh. You must think I'm an imbecile. Uh -huh. Do you know what Jim's gonna do to me for this? No, but I can't wait to find out. And I'm sure that my readers are dying to know too. Sissy, since when have you been involved with the Caddick News, huh? Ever since I made myself editor-in-chief. Oh, and since you're all together as usual, I'd like to ask Yumi a few questions for the next issue. What are you two waiting for? Come on, we're rolling! Well, Yumi, our readers would really like to know how you and William are getting along. Uh, w William? M me and William? I, I don't know what you're talking about. Would you rather I ask the same question of William? He may not be as shy as you are. As a matter of fact, where is he? The last time I saw him was a week ago. He's gone abroad. His father called your father to tell him. <laughs> oh, how come you know that, huh? It, uh, I, uh... Are you talking about me? Huh? All I can remember is being virtualized on Lyoko and being captured by the Skithozoa. It's a blank after that. That is till this morning when I woke up in the factory. Hey, what are you doing, Odd? You're hurting me. Just checking to make sure you're not one of Xana's ghosts. No danger of that. There isn't any activated tower on Lyoko. William couldn't have been sent by Xana. So you can <laughs> stop fishing me, Odd. <laughs> Anyhow, you're just in time for a quiz in math. Timing, huh? I haven't studied at all. So, since when have you ever studied? <laughs> <laughs> The next problem is explaining William's sudden return to Delmas. Yeah, you said it. What I don't get is why, when Lyoko disappeared, William didn't fall into the digital sea. It's really weird. I'd love to know how he managed to escape. Who is it? Hi, Anita. We're not disturbing you, I hope. We would really like to do a feature story on you for our next issue. It's true that we don't know a lot about you. Are you really Odd's cousin? And, well, is it really all that cold in Canada? And why did you suddenly come here in the middle of the year? Our readers are interested. <laughs> Can't you let her study in peace, huh? All right, get going, oh. all three of you. You've annoyed her enough. Oh, William, you came back. I thought you were overseas. Get going, I said. Okay, okay, we're out of here. Thanks, William. Without you, I'd have been Sissy's next victim, and that's even worse than that. You're becoming a prisoner of Xana. Is that what you're saying? <gasps> William only came back because of Aelita. That's a scoop, isn't it? No. I can't wait to tell the news to Jeremy and see what he has to say. No, hold on. There's no reason for him to know before our readers do. Once we've printed it, then we'll ask Jeremy what he thinks of it. William came to Aelita's room? You're kidding. Are you sure he did? We sure are. We were there. What do you think? Well, uh, I think that, um, I know why. She's gonna help him catch up on, um, what he missed in math. Uh, look, I'm sorry, but I gotta go now. I'll take a shower. Sissy, you want a scoop? Hmm? A real one this time? Okay, here, I quit. So do I, Sissy. But you couldn't possibly do that. What, what a bet. Yeah, Jeremy? Lorik, there's something weird going on with William. Why? What's wrong? He left for the factory with Aelita. I picked up the signals of their cell phones. I'm pretty sure this is Xana's doing. What makes you think that? Just a hunch. It's strange that he escaped the digital sea. Meet you at the factory, okay? Right, no problem. You get Yumi, I'll clue Odd in. You mean he's not with you? Odd? No, as a matter of fact, I don't know where he is. 
Go on, keep trying. I'm sure you can do a lot better than that. You remember the scene, don't you? You told me that you've watched the film a dozen times, right? But Jim, I swear it's not my fault. I didn't tell anybody. You're gonna continue until you know the steps by heart. <sighs> Unless, of course, you'd like me to change your class instead. <laughs> All your pals will be so sorry not to have you with them. Uh... Yeah. Hmm. Okay, okay, I get the picture, Jim. Han was right. This film is incredibly funny. <laughs> oh no, just when I was trying to chill out. John, I've already tried three times. Yeah, I'll bet he's living it up somewhere just when we need him. Sector 5, and I don't like that at all. Hurry, Ulrich. Head for the scanner room. I'm on my way. I keep trying to reach Odd. I'm really gonna be needing him. That's better. Much, much better. Just a few more hours and you'll be all set. Oh no, where could Odd be, I wonder? I'm ready, Jeremy. Okay, I'll launch the procedure. Transfer forward. Scanner, forward. Virtualization. Forward, you've got to take the corridor right in front of you. Is there a key I've got to trip? No, when we recreated Sector 5, we got rid of that procedure. Okay, here I go. Better step on it while they're not too far away, Ulrich. Once you're in the core zone, I'll guide you. without inviting us? You sure have changed, haven't you? <laughs> Be careful, Ulrich. Xana sent some creepers just behind you. Super smoke! And I thought this was gonna be easy. Ailita, can you hear me? Jeremy. What's going on? Very careful, Ailita. William's coming after you. What was the matter with him? I have no idea. The tower in Sector 5 hasn't been activated, but it seems that William is under the control of Xana. You'd better get out of there fast, Ailita. Fast! Ulrich and Ailita really need your help. And Odd? I've been trying to reach him. I don't know where he is. I can't take any more of this, honestly, Jim. Now that, my friend, is what you should have thought about before talking to the press. Ah! Ah! There he is! I told you I recognize the music! Baby! Just what are you doing up at this hour, all of you? Your disco film is incredible, too! You mean you liked it that much? It's a masterpiece! Would you give us your autograph, Jim? Yeah. Uh, yeah, why, sure. I'd be happy to if that's what you want. Oh, no! 
Do Lakeisha, is that right? <laughs> Right, now get to the scanner room. You're gonna go in a little trip. Funky! Understand. At the end of Sector 5, there's nothing except the digital sea. If he jumps into it with Aelita, she'll be devirtualized for good. Just like her father. Don't worry, Jeremy. We'll do all we can to stop him. But for that, we're gonna need our vehicles. Right. I'll see that you get them in no time flat. <laughs>
cut in, William, but Elena has always preferred the company of a real gentleman. being tailgated. You think William's gone forever? Mm. No, I think he just went back to his new master, Xana. Why would William want to drag me into the digital sea? I don't get it. Well, I think it's part of Xana's new strategy, and so we've got to be very careful. William could come back at any time. And now we have to think up another excuse for his absence, and Delmas might not buy it this time. Hello, Jeremy. Hi, Hello. Jeremy. Hello. <laughs> they don't hate you now? I guess they found someone they can hate even more. You're kind of like us and William. Oh, 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 oh,